Hello, beautiful people of YouTube. It's me again, Anyx. I hope you're all doing wonderful. Today, I am going to be showing you how I made this necklace. This video is going to be relatively short, but I still hope you enjoy it. So anyways, let's just get started. So I started off with buying some big beads and some string. This string isn't usually the type of string that we use to make a bracelet or a necklace, but I really wanted to try it out, try something different, something that, well, I just haven't done before. Even though it did cost me a little problems, I really do love how it came out. So, even with the big size beads, I still couldn't get it to fit. So what I did was that I grabbed my pliers and I started cutting the tip of it at an angle slowly going thinner and thinner until it was thin enough that I could put the bead through and then just start gently and slowly plus carefully pulling the string until I was able to just shove it in there it was a really tight fit but I was able to manage to get it in even though a few times it did end up breaking on me but it was worth it. So these are the beads that I used. This is uh, so far halfway done. I did in the end rearrange the beads, but I think it was t turned out for the better. So taking these clasps, I'm going to attach them to each end of the string, like so. Just put the string through the middle and close it up. I do believe I closed this clasp wrong, um, I don't know if that's how it's supposed to look like, but I just went with it. So taking this clasp and a lobster claw, I'm going to put the clasp through the claw, and I'm going to attach it to the... Dang it, I forgot what it's called. I'm just going to call it a clasp. And then taking another clasp, connect it to the other clasp, if that makes any sense, so it can have something to lock on to. For extra pizzazz, style, whatever you want to call it, I put on this beautiful, but I mean beautiful, tassel that I bought a few days ago. Seriously, I'm in love with this tassel. I'm actually planning on making some earrings. So, even with all of that, I still thought that the necklace looked very plain looking and simple. So what I did was that I took the clasp that I had installed at the beginning of the string and I cut off the top part which held the circle so you can connect it to things. So I just put this part on the empty uh, spaces in the necklace and I closed them off to make it look kind of like a cuff. Uh, anyway, you'll see, you'll see what I mean. So that's it. That's literally it. As I said, it's pretty simple, very short video. This is how it looks on. As I said, I think it looks amazing. I'm in love with it. I might actually just keep it instead of selling it. By the way, modeled by yours truly. So I really hope you like this video. Leave a comment, like, subscribe, share. It would help me out a lot. And I'll see you all in the next video. Bye.